Hello everyone, in this video we will see a demo of on submit client script that how can we create one and with an example. If you want to know about the introduction of client scripts and the explanation of each type of client script, please click on the top right corner. So in this demo, I have created a custom field called alternate mobile number and we will be validating this field while we are submitting the form and we will check if it has only 10 numbers. No other characters and the number of characters should be 10. So this can be also done on on change client script but the problem with on change client script is that it will actually validate only when the value of field has changed and the user will be able to submit the form with the incorrect value. Let me show you a demo. I have created a client script already called validate mobile number on change. So this is an on change type of client script and I am validating this here that the user has entered only 10 digits and I will show them the error otherwise I will say the it's the correct mobile number I will go to one incident record and you can see the alternate mobile number is given as 2323 if I actually change the number it will say that please enter 10 digits and a valid mobile number if I give 9876543210 it will say it's the correct mobile number. So now I will try input an incorrect mobile number and I will save this. And you notice that how it did not stop me from actually updating an incorrect value. So this is where the on submit client script comes in and it validates while you are trying to submit or update the form. I will just copy this code and I will go to client scripts again and I will create new and I will say validate mobile number on submit I will give the table name as incident the UI type as desktop if I want to run it on mobile phones or the service portal as well I can select this one and if I want to select all so it will run at both the places as of now I will select desktop in the type I will select as on submit and if you want this on submit to be run on the child tables of incident table you can check this checkbox and if you want to run on all of the views you can select global here and if you want to run it on some specific view you can uncheck this and give the name of the view and now I will paste my code here and I have made some changes I have used g underscore form dot get value which will get the current value of the mobile number and I will add the error message on top of the form that please enter a valid mobile number if it's not valid and the return false will actually stop the form from submitting and it will just show the error message. I will save this. I will go back to the incident form. I will refresh. And if I make some changes here, it will show please enter a valid number of 10 digits. But when I try to submit this, it will show me error at top of the screen and as well as it did not allow me to save the form. So this is how you can use the on submit client script and use for the validations while the submission of the form. I hope you like this video. Please subscribe to my channel.